We are now filming. Um, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna get some video here from looking straight ahead. Cause I want to get a, a head a headshot of the storm. There you go. All right, I got film rolling right now or video rolling, and I'm looking at the dust cloud. Well, it's not really a dust cloud, but it's. Uh, it's a lot of dirt getting ready to blast me. Should be here at just about uh, 30 seconds here. In fact, my legs are all dirty from the dirt. Okay, I cannot see US 281 now. That's how thick the dirt is. I cannot see US 281. That's a. It, it's what? What road is this? That this would be Northwest 20th Street. So Northwest 20th Street. Yes. All right. The winds now are have intensified. They're gusting uh, 45 to 50 mile an hour now. And visibilities are less than one quarter of a mile. And I just got a lightning strike to my west. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That wouldn't surprise me. Okay. Okay, US 281, I cannot see the road. Okay, that's not. Okay, Roger that. Okay, I'm going to get a picture real quick. Man, the dust here is just nasty. Uh, the rain shaft has not hit me just yet, but it's literally on my doorstep. Uh, I cannot see a quarter of a mile in front of me looking north northwest. Yeah, they said up in that area where the moderate risk was at, they're supposed to see up to 90 mile an hour winds and up to three inch hail. I'm getting uh, over 50 some mile an hour winds now. Very strong winds. Starting to rock the truck a little bit. Truck is rocking just a little. Okay. Okay, and I still cannot see a quarter of a mile. Actually, now I can't even see not even an eighth of a mile front, in front of me. I can barely. Yeah, the gust front's already past me, but I'm still getting considerable dirt and grain dust out here. Nice. Yeah, and I'm actually getting it on, on video uh, looking uh, north northwest. Okay, I'm getting. I'm gonna get a video shot of the airport. You can barely see the the airport. That's how thick the dust is. Okay, I'm getting shot of the airport and you can barely see, the, you can't even see the airport now. Okay, you can't see the airport now. It's uh, it's shrouded in a cloud of dust and grain dust. That's crazy, man. So we're getting 50 to 55 mile an hour winds now and I'm getting ready to move out. All right, I'm getting some sprinkles now at my location. Am I, is, where's the leading edge of the rain at? All right, while you're doing that, I'm gonna tilt the camera back really quick, okay? Okay. Real quick, I'm gonna go ahead and move because the rain shaft is almost on top of me at this location. I'm gonna go ahead and move, and I'm gonna go about a mile and a quarter south. Just, just to play it safe right now. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm gonna play it safe and head, head back south. Oh man, there. 
there's a major dust cloud right over Pratt. Major, major dust cloud. You cannot even see 281 Highway. I'm gonna get it here in just a sec. Actually, I'm gonna let this truck go by. Okay, getting a picture right over Pratt. All right, got the dust cloud. Man, that's a nice dust cloud too. Okay, I had to move over because I had to let a guy go by. Oh my, <laughs> what a nice time for my camera to be tilted. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna reposition it here. And just, oh, lightning strike just northeast of me. Cloud to ground. All right, repositioning the camera. There we go. It wasn't it wasn't very straight. I'm still getting winds 50 to 55 mile an hour. Well, we haven't seen this kind of wind in quite a long time. All right. All right, now we're rolling some video. All right, headed back south now on 281 Highway. Headed back south about a mile and a quarter. I'm getting a nice uh, in-cab view of that dust cloud. I'm gonna try not to go too fast because I want to get a nice view of the, the dust cloud. Yeah, there's there's rain right behind me. It's getting ready to swallow me up. Still getting 50 to 55 mile an hour gusts out this way. They're not sustained, but it's gusting that. And that's just me estimating. Lucky I got brand new wipers the other day for this. <laughs> okay, I cannot see Pratt. Yeah, I cannot see Pratt and I cannot see the uh, northeast side of where the college is at and the water towers. That's how thick the dust is. It basically is, but it's a dust storm with uh, grain dust. Hey, now you are 55, right? What? No, nah, I'm actually going into it right now. Yeah, and I'm gonna I'm gonna turn the camera back northwest. Yeah, I can't even. I can barely see a quarter. Well, I'd say half mile in front of me now. Be careful. How about how about a hail report? Anything interesting? Okay, and it shouldn't be a big orb coming through. Uh, so it's getting to the rain's getting heavier now, so I think it's starting to set in on good rain. I think. Okay, now the Pratt County Sheriff's Office is starting to report in on the on the situation out here. All right, dust storm in progress over here, just off Northwest 10th Street. Dust storm in progress. Yeah, this is all from the from the wheat field, and I'm actually going to get a shot of it right now. All right, I'm getting a video shot as we speak. Well, no, I'm actually recording right now. The what? No, because I have no way of, of doing it from my camera. So I'm using my big camera, not the little one. All right, I'm getting uh, close to 60 mile an hour winds now. I mean, they're extremely strong. I'm gonna turn around really quick. 
but the dust and the dirt is just unfreaking real. Lots of rain cooled air out here. All right, to my north, there is no more no more dust being uh, seen, as I think the rain is intensified just northwest of me. I'm still getting dirt and dust down here. Yeah, you're telling me that. Kept, I'm gonna look. Uh, gonna look north real quick. All right, I'm still getting pelted by dirt. Okay, now I'm starting to get the leading edge of the rain. And I'm still getting hit by at least 50 to 55 mile an hour winds. What I'll probably end up doing is I'm gonna park by the depot, because that's a good place for videos, by the depot. Yeah. Plus, there's a building right there that, in case it starts to hail like really big, I can take cover over there. Okay, the rain is starting to, in, well, it's not intensifying just yet, but I can actually see the, the rain shaft. I can actually see right where I was at on Northwest 20th Street. You can actually see the rain coming down horizontal, well I wouldn't say horizontal, but it's coming down pretty good. Now I'm starting to get some big drops of rain here now. Big drops of rain. I'm just north of the, north of Northwest 10th Street. Okay, my truck is rocking again. Winds are still big, uh, pretty strong. And we're still getting a little bit of du uh, dust, but it's starting to settle with the rain. It's settling now. get a shot yeah there's a shot I just got at the the leading edge of the rainfall on video and I'm looking north towards 281 highway and we still got traffic going on 281 highway and the truck is rocking baby she's a rocking you always want to face the wind right if it's a high wind situation okay I'm facing the wind Okay, yeah, I'm facing the wind. I'm, I'm looking straight north, and I'm, I'm getting, uh, I'm still getting traffic going, but traffic is rather slow. Uh huh. All right, winds have picked up. I think we're getting, we're getting very close to 60 mile an hour winds now. Okay, here's our, here's a new warning. Stand by. And the truck is really rocking now. She's a rocket. The National Weather Service in New City has issued a severe thunderstorm. Here comes the rain. Northern Pratt County in South Central Kansas, Southeastern Stafford County in South Central Kansas, until 6:45 p.m. Northern Pratt County time. At 5.55 p.m. Central Daylight Time, severe thunderstorms were located along the line extending from Zenith to Byers and moving east at 20 miles per hour. This east. replaces the previous warning. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Expect damage to roofs, siding and trees. Locations impacted include Ayuka, Neola, Preston, and Cairo. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of the building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties in Kansas, Pratt, and Stafford. Okay. All right, Northern Pratt County until, until whenever it's said. <laughs> Okay, truck is, uh, winds are subsided just a little bit. They're not as strong now. I think they're gusting to 50 now. 50 or just a little below 50. Yeah, we're still getting strong winds, but not as strong as they were just a, about two minutes ago. Uh, we got a, I'd say it's not a moderate rain, but it's a pretty steady rain, but it's wind driven. Yeah, and I can see the leading edge right on. It's just, oh, it's just overhead. I mean, it's slowly moving in. Yeah, it's really slow moving in. 
was how fast is it moving? Is it like moving 20 mile an hour? Well, it sure don't feel like it because it, I, I haven't even hit the leading edge of the rain yet. Or, the leading edge of the rain? Well, yeah, I'm getting rain now, but I'm talking about the heaviest rain. I haven't even gotten the heaviest rain yet. I, I, uh -huh. Okay. I mean... Okay, yeah, I'm getting some big drops now. I'm getting big droplets of rain. Uh, no hail to speak of as of yet. And Sheriff's Office isn't reporting any hail either. Okay, but I'm, I'm now seeing the wind-driven rain in front of me. Okay, I'm seeing the wind-driven rain in front of me. Um, I'm panning back over and getting a shot of it, like, if it's pretty clear. Yeah, because I can see a wall of, of heavy rain right in front of me. Uh, it still looks like it's about a mile, mile and a quarter north of me. That's just estimating it. That's just a, a sheet of just solid rain. And it still hasn't hit me yet. But I can see it right here on the pavement that it's just whipping, you know, it's whipping around it and going from northwest to southeast. Uh, winds are dying down now. I'd say we're getting between 40 and 45 now, gusting. They're not as strong as they were earlier. Okay, truck's rocking just a little bit. So that's about 45 when the truck's rocking. Now, it's, it, it's lightened up some. And lightning's not as intense out here either. Lightning's not too bad. It's basically been... Well, there's money down in here. Oh, it sounds like the railroad's coming in. Oh, got a new warning coming out. Stand by. <laughs> my, my phone is all dirty. The National Weather Service in Wichita. Oh, this is for the Wichita market. Storm warning for Kingman County in South Central Kansas. 6.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 5.59 p.m. Central Daylight Time, severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from Arlington to Penalosa to Sawyer and moving southeast at 45 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Expect damage to roofs, siding and trees. Locations impacted include Kingman, Nashville, Zeta, Kingman Airport, Willowdale, Cleveland, Montana, Vernon, Spivey, Murdoch, and Rago. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Kingman County, Kansas. <laughs> Well, it sounds like it's down in the Sawyer now. They just said it was it was in Sawyer. Okay, that's probably what they're talking about is, is the gust front.
just not getting any heavy rain out here. I mean, I can see, I can see in front of me now that. I mean, here's. Uh, it's north and west, you said. Oh, really? Yeah, because I'm just not getting like the heaviest rainfall or anything. I'm still getting strong winds. But... If you want the high you can see it. Oh, it's just rain and wind. Okay, well, you know what? Let's just do it. Let's go up to Ayuka. Let's give it a shot. Alright, we're gonna head north then. Alright, hang on. I'm getting ready to head north.
messed the rest of the video out of the whole thing. So, I'm not disappointed. Yes, sir. We've still got normal traffic flowing up here north of, or uh, headed south on uh, 281, by the way. And I already see a clear spot. I see a clear spot to the northwest. Okay, real quick, look at what's east of uh, Ayuka. Tell me what's over to the east. Ah, uh, doesn't matter. I see a lot of, I just see a sheet of heavy rain uh, out to the east. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and head eastbound. Uh, there's a paved road that heads up toward Preston. I'm gonna take that and head east. I gotta get up here first. Okay. Just tell me how far I am from the hail. Okay, oh, we got a nice lightning strike to my door. Okay, I'm now headed, okay, tra uh, track this on here. I'm headed now east on 60th Street, just north of Ayuka, 60th Street. Yeah, that is correct, that would be uh, 61 Highway. But I can't go straight east because that's a dirt road and I don't want to get caught in the mud. But there's another road that's about a mile north that heads east. Alright, winds have decreased down here. I'd say they're running about 35 gusty. Alright, well I'm gonna I'll go ahead and head up over here real quick. I wanna see. Okay, I'm, I'm hitting the curve now. Hit the curve here. Okay, there's the curve. Uh, now we're gonna be headed north. Hang on. Northbound on Northeast 10th Avenue. Headed northbound. Okay, now I'm now northbound on Northeast 10th Avenue. To another, uh, either 70th, uh, 70th Street or 80th Street. That's the paved road that heads all the way to this. I'm still getting some fairly uh, moderate winds, I'd say gusty 45 out here. And now the combines are at a halt up here. Combines are at a halt. No, no cutting up here. Okay, now headed eastbound on 70th Street, Northeast 70th Street. I'm headed eastbound. Rain has decreased in intensity, but we still got strong winds. I'm headed towards Preston then. Gotcha. And that heads to 54 Highway. Okay, copy that. What I'll do is I'll, I'll shoot over towards uh, Cairo once I get down to Preston. We'll see what I find out there. And I may lose cell service because there's a pocket in there where the cell service is really bad. Okay, so far I don't really see a whole lot out here. Um, I see a lot of, uh, it looks like a sheet of heavy rain to my south. Uh, kind of, sort of. Uh, I don't think so. It looks more gray than white. Yeah. Hey, at least 
least my steering is better now. I'm not wobbling back and forth like I was a week ago. Okay, I got some just under moderate rain. It's a, it's a steady rain now. Uh, winds have decreased out here probably less than 20 mile an hour now. I got a new warning coming out, stand by. Yeah, 20 to 30 out here. Yeah, I can see a, what looks like a sheet of rain out here to the, to the south of me.